Good morning, Internet. I went to start packing today, and my lovely fiance, fiance, look at she's already packed everything. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Put if on I, pants? If I didn't do it, though, you would just throw it in there, and then nothing would fit. Well, here's the thing, though. I thoroughly appreciate the organization. But, but it's gonna get all messed up. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna take a photo of day two of work for. I'm not worried about it. I feel. I feel happy that I could put it in there. So and it where, looks where good. can you fit? Are you gonna fit right in the corner? Tomorrow we have rehearsal, and to make my life easier, rather than flying to work tour, and then like every other year where I'm dragging my my stuff through all the buses, I thought since the tour bus is actually gonna be at the rehearsal spot, that I should pack early or in this case, Ali packs for me. And that way I bring it to rehearsal and then I just put on the tour bus and the tour bus delivers it. I just wanted to try and help you out a little bit. That's tremendous help. Because I know it's stressful, you know? Oh, you look really cute, Rico Suave. Show me some of that skin. You like it? <laughs> All my shirts, they fit when I buy them and then I put them into the well, washing Well, you stretch machine. them out after you dry them and then what do you think is going to happen? Nothing's going to be uniform. I yes, you just do. just go, hey, I'm cleaning my clothes, and then I pull them out, and then it's like, hey, now it's like this. It's ridiculous. So guys, look at this. Are you still peeling? Look at that. Can you see all this? Should I wear my Jordans? So gross. Diesel, what do I pack? You're not helping. What do I pack, buddy? Well, you look pretty packed right now. Oh, wait. That dreaded time has come. We are packing for Charles to head off to work for us. It's not really a dreaded time, but... Not my Jordan shirt. I know, it was up there. I want my Jordan shirt. Okay. But as you guys know, Charles is leaving for Warped Tour and it's always so, I don't know, it's sad. It's definitely sad packing for him to leave, but I know he has so much fun. The band has so much fun. One? And you no. You, don't, you got it for me. I know, I got it as a joke. See that, guys? Super callous, <laughs> Super callous, sexy, hella dopeness. I so did. I found that and I just thought it was so funny. I come on stage, Travis goes, nope. <laughs> I got that when I was with my older sister and we like did like a really random Walmart night. We came across like, I don't know, one of those racks that was like on a super super sale and that was on there and we both looked at each other and she's like, I'm just getting this so I have to tell my kids they have to wear it. And then I was like, I'm getting it for Charles because I'm going to make him wear it. And she's like, exactly. And we both thought, we thought it was so dumb. But at the same time, we thought it was so funny. So we had to get it. Kind of a sad moment for him to leave, but I'm so excited for them because I know the guys are excited to get back out on tour and be back out on the road. And I'm excited to go to a few of the shows. I was digging through the closet, try to find another backpack on the bus so I don't have to go to the bay all the time. And look what I found. I found the thing that's going to piss everyone off on the bus. <laughs> Where was that at? My Nick Cage pillowcase. What was that? that? Somebody gave it to me and I got it and I would have it on my bus, on my bunk. And I would leave my bunk, you guys remember, I'd leave my bunk slightly open. So every time somebody walked in the back so of the bus. So basically like this. So be like this. Yeah, so you'd walk by trying to go to the uh, back of the bus and you'd just see Nicolas Cage all the time. <laughs> oh, I gotta bring that again. Yeah, because I, did you see what I pulled out? What? I wasn't sure where that one was. So I pulled out. You read the, I was looking for the Zoe Marley one too. Actually, that one's softer. Bring that one. Bring them both. Look, I found my Warped Tour hat. This one. We've always known that's in there. I refound my Warped Tour hat. So silly. Zoe, you want to try it on? You can try it on, bro. Kidding. Where's Diesel? Look, it's okay. You look handsome. Yeah. Because I only like it when I get to dress up in my mom's clothes. <laughs> this will probably engulf your whole body. It's my warp Tour hat, you be careful with that. So I need to get a couple warp Tour ready shirts so that I can just basically, you know, sound stupid, cut into like tank tops for stage because everything is so freaking hot. And I think I found the best shirt. Totally the best shirt in the world, right? <laughs> I think it's the greatest shirt ever. I just got notification by one of you guys on Instagram that they went and bought the We The King So Far album at Best Buy. I'm gonna go over here and see if I can buy a couple copies of my own album. For the very first Is that time weird? ever. I think that's no, awesome. I think that's kind of cool, actually. I think it's awesome. Like... I think it's, it's, it's kind of weird, though. Uh, I hope they have it. Holy sh! They have it. Oh my god! Right there. That is very cool. That's amazing, actually. <laughs> so apparently, they still sell CDs here. That is. Super We're cool. in between Whitechapel and Wiz Khalifa. Oh, there's a Warped Tour CD. 
I kind of want to just sign it, but we don't have a Sharpie, do we? Would I get in trouble for signing my own album? Yeah. Yeah, I guess that, that technically is not mine. Super cool. I think it's it's kind of weird. I take I always look. I've seen my dad. You know, looking for a you know, Greg Allman band. I've seen him in the, the album, like the CD stores. But now I get to go, oh, go look at, I want to see if my band's in there. And I get to actually say that. I think that's a really cool kind of thing. And I think my dad would be very proud about that situation. I think that's cool. Following in your dad's footsteps. Yep. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day, Dad. And to we all the it. other dads. <laughs> and every other dad. We did it. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. And you know what's actually really kind of cool, you can't see the, the sticker, but if you look very careful, the internet is technically there too, because that's the camera, I'm filming the audience. If you get the album, you can see it. It's even cooler to me. The internet's on there, and our album's in the store. Congrats. You go buy it. Should I go and buy it and be like this? <laughs> put it down first? No. I'd be like, have you ever heard of this band? Just put it, that band right here? Right here? Have you heard of this band? Do you recognize this guy right here? Really bad. <laughs> you seem very giddy about this. I'm I think it's like really, really cool. It is very cool. I really, honestly, I was just saying, like, I would always see this has been from my dad. Greg Allman Live. There's my dad's band right there. So I am in the store, and so is my dad. High five, Dad. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. That's very cool. I kind of want to just like run out the door right, and steal my like, own album. He's not gonna like cool for you giving your dad Coldplay? Yeah, I was giving him Coldplay. No, your dad's not gonna like Coldplay. He does like Coldplay. He likes Alicia Keys. He likes Alicia Keys? He does. That's kind of funny. But this is gonna bring him back. This is where you're getting your dad. Some essentials. You know what you need in there? The We the King album. I was. But we didn't buy the last one. We left it for one of you guys to go off and get. So we're in St. Pete, right? Which St. Pete is this? 22nd Street? 22nd Avenue, Best Buy, the only Best Buy concert. Okay, we left the one copy left of the We The King album for you guys. Ali just reminded me that I need a bag. You know all the times I have to go take the showers the way off to wherever they're at? So I needed to get, get a, off that stank. Gotta get that stank off. And we have a shower on the bus this time again. You know how quick and cold those things. And we got the shower bags. Actually, do we need to get another shower bag? Maybe we'll get those at the first Walmart stop. Yeah. Anyway. And also, like every time I go to Warp Tour or on Warp Tour, I always like towel. really figure out like how a pink towel. You have to always get something that people won't steal. Because everyone steals everything on Warp Tour. Here go. I have to no steal. No, I don't think anyone's gonna take that. And I got a speed rope because every time I'm on Warp Tour, I always really focus on trying to get healthy, and I always end up losing like 20 pounds on Warp Tour just from sweating alone. Got you some Freedom Bears. Freedom. That take your, your your teeth out. Caitlin and I are meeting up with my dad for Father's Day. We got him like a. This is how weird my family's personality mm -hmm. and demeanor is. We thought it would be funny to get my dad this bag. So <laughs> see, it says so stinking, so cute. stinking cute, and and it's definitely for a, a little shower. boy or a, like a a baby shower. And then we got him a card, and it says. Happy Father's Day, Grandpa. Yeah. Yeah, it says Happy Father's Day, Grandpa. And yes, he's Grandpa, but he's not a Grandpa by us, which he's going to totally think one of that us one of us is pregnant. But inside <laughs> we wrote, like, you are a Grandpa, dot, 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 but not by us. Happy Father's Day, old fart. <laughs> Dad, if you're watching this, I'm really sorry. Please don't hate us. Okay, what are you up to? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, <laughs> it's Father's Day, Grandpa, <laughs> and in case you haven't heard it lately. <laughs> Grandpa? <laughs> but... You guys enjoy uh, your meal. Uh, uh, happy Father's Day, you old fart. <laughs> That's good. Darn it, Dad, you caught That's on a little good. late. For a minute there, I thought mm. one of you was pregnant. That's that what we were trying. Plan. That was what we that, wanted you to think. But Dad, I thought your reaction was going to be a lot more extreme. Well, it was going to be, but I tried to tone it down. <laughs> Alright, just ran. I ran three miles myself, and I walked the dogs, walked, jogged the dogs for about a mile. So I just did about four, four miles, give or take. My warp Tour, I like to call it my warp Tour body. I have all my stuff. I got my perfect push-ups. 
my rubber band things, my jump ropes. I get really excited for Warp Tour because of the fact that it's like, it really pushes me to exercise because I find exercising being incredibly boring. Ali always asks me to go to the gym and I always find it really, really stupid. Not stupid because it's, it's good for you, but I don't like being inside and going nowhere, if that makes any sense. Like if you're on like a treadmill, I, I hate feeling like you're literally running in place. That's also why I love Warp Tour because every day is a different scene. So it makes you feel like you're running across the country like Forrest Gump. Sorry, I feel like I have hiccups again. I do, actually I do. Go away. Also because Warp Tour I find it's like incredibly boring. Actually, I shouldn't say incredibly boring. It's, you gotta find a lot to do with your time because you wake up, you find the cleanest porta potty TMI, I know. You find out when you're playing. The porta potty is before finding out when you play, trust me. When you're on tour, trust me. <laughs> that's, that's gross, I know. And watch some bands. I'm personally gonna be watching Yellow Card pretty much every day and some 41 every single day. So if you come to Warp Tour, try to find me. I'm probably at those two stages. That is not a nacho. Hey, Diesel. That is not a buffalo wing. Do you want buffalo wings? Do you see what that idiot's doing? <laughs> like clockwork every single day. I couldn't go to dinner because I was packing everything and getting everything ready. I'm still not done. But my lovely, again, my lovely fiance, look what she brought me. Taters. Taters? You're all right. And you're, you're all right. And you got, um, mm. thank you. And you got um, chicken brine. Chicken John. Chicken brine. She's okay. I made sure the mashed potatoes were okay. Can I have a pillow back, please? 